one of these days. Trust me, I'm not trying. Anyway, I was saying coins here aren't bad. Or, yeah, coins here aren't actually bad. I should just chain long jump this. I don't know why I'm not. Here we go! Here we go. Oh, it's because I died. Because I, I don't really want to face the consequences of the other ones. <laughs> yeah, overworlds in this game are really weird. It's kind of like five overworlds, sort of. But not really out of Shut up. That should be a concept. <laughs> Whatever the it fuck I just concept. did, is a, it should be a concept you did. It is a concept. Icy Skid used that in her part of Chaotic Collab. Lava bouncing into Goomba. Or, yeah, Lava bouncing into Goomba bounce. Well, because you actually control better on the Goombas after the Lava bounce. Yeah. I don't know where Star 1 is, by the way. At the top. I mean, I actually, I say that, but I saw the, um, I saw some dripping yellow madness I've, I've never used. Dripping yellow madness. I was actually having a really hard time trying to figure out what to do for seven more stars in this level. Well, then, you, also, you just decided to change the level up heavily. <laughs> I mean, that came after, but even despite that, I was still trying to ha have a lot of trouble. I, I had, like, even more trouble. And then with, you like, actually had to come up with 14 different yeah, for... different star locations. Yeah, we don't talk about Course 14. Is course it, 14 is has it, one of the... Is it uninspired, or is it just shit? No, it's very inspired. It's just really, really hard. Yeah, it is it, one of the hardest... Yeah, because it's Kaizo cubed. True. I, course 14 has... Probably... Dave had a sprite cubed. Yeah, I, w I don't know if Course 15 has the hardest star. Like, like, it doesn't have the hardest star, but it has probably the hardest single jump in the game, I would guess. Can I name Homestuck characters now? You can, but, like, why? Yes, I need... Because I'm all... Because I need commentary, Kevin. <laughs> Oh, no. You can you can compare this to MQ one and a half. It's so yeah. Uh, you need the heart health. Yeah, evidently. Yeah, I don't know why that heart doesn't. Maybe I should raise this one. It's fine as is. It's because unless you're ch it's, unless you chain it, it doesn't spin because you get the because it's actually the speed you mm, have going through yeah. it is a, is a lava boost and not a long jump. Yeah, yeah, you're right. That's that's why that happened. I see now. This is just like taking shit out of the Dream Edition, <laughs> like Treasure World, like random thin platforms. No reason. I was out of ideas. So it's just like let's expand the level into the air. That's how all the cool kids do it. Yeah. Brrr. This is probably the hardest stone course one. Yeah, because I keep fucking landing on the wrong part. I like the two seconds of silence at the start of the state. <laughs> <laughs> it's a moment of tranquility. What do you mean? What's wrong? No. Yeah. What is this collision? I don't know, but the game's telling me to fuck off, so I'll, I'll do it. I'll do it.
I don't like this turnaround he does. <laughs> yeah, I don't get that either. You should just be able to land on top of it. There we go. I, Kevin, I full cleared a course. Are you proud of me? Yeah, actually, I'm, I'm extremely proud of you. Um, fine. <laughs> I'd do course four if I could get star one. <laughs> I mean, the other stars aren't that bad. It's not like the hints will help. You know. Ugh. <laughs> or you can go for Dory's cursed rodeo. Do I still have to stall for Dory? <laughs> I mean, I, 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 I don't know if stall stalling helps. Isn't that what you had to do in MQ2? Actually, no. You wanted to rush, I think. I thought you needed to wait for Dory to be in the right position. I don't know. Maybe it helps a little bit, but if you get a really lo oh, perfect long jump, like a long enough perfect From jump, where? You can... no, not a long jump, like a long enough perfect oh. jump. Oh. Oh. The boxes. Shut up. Just say it's possible. Maybe you do want to stall for Dory. You were supposed to stall on MQ2. I remember this vividly. Like, I actually remember this, like, profusely as a mechanic of MQ2. Slide. And I'm telling you, I did it without stalling in my recent playthrough. Okay, you got better. I guess I did. I do remember you telling me to call it that. Stall, call, fuck. <laughs> what if I just went for reds? All two of them. I mean, you could. You could. There's nothing stopping you from it. This is a good stage, by the way. I like how it this is. one made it in. <laughs> Exclusively because of... I'm starting to learn if I make any request in one of your hacks, it gets followed through on. <laughs> uh, I mean, not entirely. There are a few things you asked for that I couldn't add. Sorry. Like what? Um... I don't remember asking for anything about this game. Besides making the joke about the old suicide. Because every fucking Kaizo hack is OSS. Mm, true. That's what the joke is. I mean, yes, that is exactly what the joke is. Fucking dickhead. <laughs> Welcome to the Cursed Story Rodeo. Is this different? Yes, because the, 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 the star is in Timbuktu. You have to actually parkour on Dory. I had to do that in the original. No, you didn't. You just slide into the star. No, oh wait, no, sorry, you had to do that in MQ2 too. Yeah, you could use a shell for that, so... Kevin, listen, I told you, I don't remember what game is what. I mean, that's perfectly fine. Yeah, you're thinking of Dory's Cosmic I'm thinking, This is I'm, Dory's Cursed Road. I'm thinking, it, yes. Mm -hmm. The star is actually really hard. Definitely the hardest star in course, too. It's a good fucking star! I couldn't just not have Dory, okay? Well, they, I just remember this being shit, because... Can I do this for a while? No, because it stops. Uh, no. She... Dory moves an inch every time, every, like, th time she raises her head, though. It's already going to shit, I can tell. I like having to ground pound to reorient yourself. Is that the strategy? I guess. It's my strategy. Sometimes you can get more uh, in than others. Listen to this beautiful acapella. How far did you ever get in in uh, Mario 64? Like, a, like, 
uh, TT family. Which was so an you SSL. Didn't, you, you, yeah, so I, I only did, did two get streams of that game. Yeah, you should get back to it. It's also a good game. More people really need. I want more people to play that game. It's so forgotten. It's like it, a really it's, good hack. Hold on, I'm, hold on. What? Okay, you really shouldn't. Yo! Yo, what's up, chatter? Yeah. Oh, you have someone? Yeah. Hello. I've had people. You really don't have any context for what the fuck this was. I don't even know if you're still here because you showed up the one second I have to walk away. Having any context for... Having any context for this requires having any context for MQ2. <laughs> I mean, I'm sliding on Dory. Do I'm I surprised at how well the star display fits. Do I have to... Is door? Do I have to, like, move on to this slope? You have to, like, jump off the side. Huh? That's not that bad. I can just ground pound Dory. Dory riding actually gets way easier when you realize you can just ground pound off the hull of them. Whenever you want. You know, uh, this game is basically an extreme edition type Kaizo hack where the base levels are from uh, one of Kevin's very old ROM hacks called Master Quest 2. Half the levels. Half the levels are new. Yeah, but they're... Well, I mean, granted, the majority of the levels that are new are the side levels, because the MQ2 had, like, no side levels. It had the slide, and then just, like, everything else was an open field. It also had... I guess, the Bowser stages, I remade those from scratch. I mean, it's the same concept, and they're based on the same geometry, but I couldn't reuse the old geometry. Also, I bought headphones for streaming after over two years, so I have no clue how audio sounds because I haven't. I didn't do a test. I jumped straight in because I'm a good streamer. You can open the next door. Yeah. Am I a winner? Oh, uh, oh, absolutely. <laughs> Oh, absolutely I will. <laughs> if I can fucking turn the camera. So how much fog do you think there will be? Do you think there will be more or less fog? I'm full of food. Um, I think there th it's going to be uh, less fog than more fog than more fog than less fog than the fog. 
Uh, it's less of a shit fest with the camera than it would be if it was vanilla camera, oh, hey, actually. Oh, oh, yeah, right, yeah. I was like, where's the warp? And I was like, oh, yeah, the warp isn't here. The warp isn't in the bathtub. There's a record point in the bathtub. Yeah. I could just use Mario Cam, but this, this lack new camera is infinitely better for, like, every other hack that exists and every other environment besides this one. Just doesn't do well inside tight walls. Oh, is it here? Yeah, it's in the hole in the wall. The hole in the wall where man can see it all? What? Cheating? Let's go. This level got quite a facelift. Also, this is where things start getting Kaito. How dare you? I can't tell- Oh, hi. Boiling veggies. Is this not more fog than the fog music? It is. That, it is not the few music. This is new music, but it's- it, this is the same level. More or less. How dare you I'll, not I'll, use the music? No, I reckon- this one- this one's fucking disguised in it. Yeah, the three trees are the three pillars. No, yeah, I... I remember it. Also, did you get the name pun? More or less. More or oh. less. You know what? I'll give you credit. <laughs> That's actually kind of funny. I, I actually don't have complaints about this hack as of the moment. So. Music's aggressive here, though. Nah, well, it's a whatever hack, so. I don't, I don't know if you, should, if you should feel good or bad about the fact that I have no complaints about this. Damn. Because usually I have complaints about your hacks, and I don't know what that says. This is one of those good, good, good parts we hear about. I like the flops. Look, okay, they're, they're, they're just hanging out. Ooh, I mean, realistically. Oh heck, I didn't even think of that. That's actually a huge problem. If you can just be okay. D6. Swamp BLJ to skip opening. Yeah, that's actually massive. I didn't even consider that. Wow. Well, I don't. Angle seems obnoxious and un. And yes, finicky. but it's definitely possible. You can skip a huge part of the. the opening. I've done swamp BLJs before, so. Yeah, cool. Um, you're not supposed to be able to do anything in here until uh, most of the stars here until you get the vanish. That right there is why I is why I play test your hacks. Yeah, exactly. Because <laughs> th th there aren't that many people who notice that. So yeah, now 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 you're sequence breaking. Can I can I stay here? <laughs> Uh, I mean, I, I, I can recommend it. This level's actually pretty hard. Well, am I in, am I in a higher difficulty overworld now because I just did that? Yeah, but I mean, yeah, Force 6 is in Section 2. Well, yeah, but it, is this plan to be further into Section 2, so therefore this part's harder? Yeah, this is, this is a pretty difficult area. I've played Night of Doom. I've played Treasure World. I, I don't have to use Night of Doom as my example. I have Treasure World. Ooh, nice. That wasn't even intended, but that is a perfectly valid way of getting out. What the fuck's intended? That seems way easier than whatever else is there. That's not even a hard jump. 
I know. It's perfectly fine. Either method is acceptable. I am perfectly fine with leaving that in. Why do you always make fucking... Make what? You should be way more careful about these swamps, buddy. I mean, this swamp is that big of a deal. There's not really much you can- at most, maybe you can BLJ on top of those trees, but you have to be extremely precise. The real problem is the BLJ- is the swamp at the start, because it's- so I, the, the vanish cap. Because it's not hard, also? Well, it's not hard. The uh -huh. BLJ? Yeah, like, yeah. It's just like- I mean, I, I- it's not like I'm bad at BLJ. I used to be bad at BLJs. I'm not bad at BLJs anymore. Good job. I love Bowser's beautiful backyard. I like what the, I like what he did with the place. <laughs> I mean, this isn't that bad. Unless yeah. I'm supposed to have like a cat or something. Nah, th this this part here is really tricky. I mean, this is still one of the easier courses. Yeah, and the, it's easier the first path. one in overall too. Oh, is it? Is this, uh, section 2 1? I don't fucking know. <laughs> you tell me, Kevin, you made the game. <laughs> uh, no, this is, this is, uh, this is the seventh course according to difficulty. So exactly. Oh, that's not what I was talking about. I was talking about, like, accessible wise. Yes. I mean, you, you, you don't get the vanish cap until, you, like,. You're not supposed to have the vanish cap for, like, another. At least, uh, like, 25 stars. Okay, now I can do this. Okay, I can do that. Hypothetically. Yeah, this wall kick section is a complete mess. <laughs> Nothing not in other games. Yeah. I just need- I just needed to switch the camera. Anyway. Now that I've sequence broke, I feel good. <laughs> I feel better about my... Imagine not letting you clip in here. Yeah, I don't actually have a planned one, or uh, planned zero star or low percent for this time. The real Kaizo was the fact that they fucking patched, was the fact that they bought a fucking wall repair. <laughs> Why the fuck did I ever do that thinking that that would be any sort of progression? What is this Dar Sanctuary ass fucking poles? What do you mean? You know what I mean. I don't remember Star Sanctuary having any poles. It has trees. No, that's... You're thinking of... The, the fuck original. you talking about? It don't, fine, maybe I'm thinking of the original. Yeah. Star Sanctuary has treeless version of the tree area. Yes. 